It was only just yesterday. I wasn't sure if I wanted to come on this trip, and I wasn't even sure how long I was gonna stay. But now that I'm actually here, I wanna stay forever. <laughs> This guy challenged me to a, a soccer match. Let's do it. Yeah. I never played before though. Get me, okay? All right, let's get it. You can be washed with yeah. the memories. Yeah, I mean, this is yeah, this is spirit Good memories. I can make you some bone bleach. Yeah, yeah. Go away, clouds! The wind is blowing the clouds away, literally in front of our faces. More! Good. I'm staying there. Oh my god. They're pushing my limits right now. I gotta get straight up this thing. Um, obviously I'm scared of heights, but we're gonna try. I'm just scared to try to get this foot <laughs> over there. So if I pull on this, I'm gonna be fine. Just don't kick yourself with the other foot. After 10 hours of driving south from Tromso, we ended up at the Scandic Hotel here in Bodo on the 16th floor. It says sweet right on it. We don't know what it looks like. I'm pumped. <laughs> Let's do it. Whoa. I'm going in first, boy. Yo, <laughs> it's got, uh, it's like it's Dude, a room. I'm getting such a nice blue tint. Binoculars and not only do we have binoculars, but we have a speaker which we'll never use, but it's so cool. And look at the view! So, this is Bodo. We have a lot to explore, but that's tomorrow. A note? Aww. Dude, look at this. But look at this. This is dangerous for me. I'm on this diet, but I can't, uh, I can't help it. I gotta have these. Look at that painting or picture, actually. That's what? crazy. Hey, comfy beds. But dude, this view is the best part. Sweet. Thank you, Scandit. Explorers, we're doing this right here. We're at Saltstruman right now, and I've never seen anything like this. The world's strongest currents, I'm not even kidding, the strongest currents are here. And what happens is, uh, after six hours of these currents going back and forth, um, they have 30 minutes of chill time, which is right now, and this is the best spot to catch fishes. Also, the number one spot people say to go diving, but you only have 30 minutes to dive before you got to get out because when those currents start up again. Now, by these currents, I mean like a maelstrom. I mean like a toilet bowl, of bowl flush. That's how crazy it is. It's already starting to form again. Here's an idea of what it looks like. We're going to be then taking a boat on, but first we're going to try to fish. That little pot right there is where the water is always coming in and coming out. But right now we have this chill time. And over here, you can start to see the currents getting stronger. I'm not kidding, this is the world's strongest currents. You'll see what I mean about that when we get on the boat and then fly the drone up. For now, we're gonna try to catch some pull-ups because that's known to be here and a lot of other huge fish. I really like how you're probably just pulling dude, up seaweed. Dude, I can't even, I can't do it. <laughs> Beginner's luck, man, right? <laughs> All right, Josh, reel it in. Catch no, us some like, lunch. I see it, dude, it's like right here. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, look at that, look at that. <laughs> My wrists are hurting. <laughs> Final cast, last one. Let's hope for the best. May the gods be with me. For Buddha! Perfect cast. <laughs> Come on, I'm feeling it. It's like trusting the cards here in Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm, I'm, I'm trusting the pole. I'm hoping for the best. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what did you just do? I don't know what happened. All right, I'm gonna stand back here. Cut the, cut the. 
Oh, we just signed our uh, waivers because we are about to go snorkeling in the currents. We're getting our briefing done right now. High risk of death. Hi, Fred right here. Hey. Hey. Oh, hey. uh, yeah, right under the bridge. Yes, 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 under the bridge here. Yeah, just yeah, there. Yeah. If not, okay. we need to maybe use another suit. So, legs in. This has been back in kindergarten where the teacher yeah. kind of helps you dress up. M <laughs> mind you, I've never been in a dry suit before. This is, this is my first time. Uh -huh. And no sweaters in between. Good. And then you take your, then you take your hands on the outside, dig in there, yeah. and then you guide yourself through. It's like being born a second time. Yes. Uh, I don't, it's fine if I get wet. But I think that's the best we have. If you, want, if you want, you can take it off the arms and necks until we come down, or you can just keep it on if you want to. If I'm gonna keep it on. If you're I feel like I'm Iron Man. <laughs> Two pair of, uh, pair of boots. Of course, that's just socks. So the question is, which size do you want? Hmm. Yep. All right, Cody, let's go save the world. Let's do it. <laughs> Cody. Uh, pretty great. Yeah, I don't even know how I look yet. I, I, I want to see myself in the mirror, but I'm gonna have to just watch this over when we edit it. Th this is it. We're about to do this right now. I'm super you excited. You ever see the movie Spy Kids? Spy Kids? You know those thumb thumbs? <laughs> <laughs> You're right. You're right. Yeah. Let's All right, do let's this. do it. That's just the power of the water just getting flooded over here, pushed. That's nothing else. It looks like as if a boat just drove through it, but it's natural. At one point, our boat literally just drifted like that. It was it was cool. <laughs> this feels like Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, the third one, when the, all the ships are surrounded in the whirlpool fighting <laughs> off each other with the cannons. That's us right now. That's us right now, yes. This is gonna be the freshest dinner I've ever had. This is this is caught just now by these guys fishing right now for us. Where are you guys from? We're from uh, Ernest, or right. yeah, it's just south, to okay. one half hour here. And what was your name? Ola. Ola. And you're a, you're a baker? Yeah, I'm a baker. Okay. And so what are we about to try today? Oh, we're about to try some uh, curd beef or um, curd uh, sausage from uh, just inside this, um, the fjord here. Okay. We also got the same, from the same place, we got some uh, baby lamb. Baby goat, actually. It's curd with some uh, uh, fresh herbs on it. Then we got a local cheese from an island just outside Bodø called uh, Chaningøy, and it's a uh, malt cheese. We got our own flatbread made from our uh, grandmother, transported from today. And oh, we wow. have yes. also some cheese made from the exact same goat. <laughs> so nice. uh, here we got a lot of so this local is a lot of local, yeah. Yeah, it's, everything is local. We got a local bear, and it's called South Streaming. <laughs> I think it's a, I said it close. You're close there. enough. You're close, close enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cheers, dude. Boom. That's good. This is good. Both the flowers and fits very nice with this fish. You just. Clean the fish from the bones and skins and everything. And you take potato, cut it up, up here, some butter, <laughs> nice chunk of butter. <laughs> nice and healthy chunk uh -huh. of butter. And then just some onions and yeah, of course sour cream. And it's like you're making your own sandwich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sour cream and uh, mustard. There you have it. Wow. You deserve it, man. Eat it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna speed over. Yeah. He made it look easy, but we can try to do this. So he said peel the skin off, right? Unless you like skin. I'll keep it on just for a bit. Extra protein, right? Extra protein, okay, huh? Okay, then, then, so, he said, that sauce. 
Sour cream with some flowers on it, by the way. It makes it better. Yep. Some butter. Good chunk. <laughs> he said good chunk, so I'm... He did say good chunk. For the video. <laughs> for the video, I'll do a good chunk too. There you don't go. break on me. Oh, <laughs> don't. And a half potato. Okay. Come on. Oh. Okay, so it's obviously... It's all scattered, but... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, it's like a messy taco. Alright. I'm not just saying this. I eat that every day. It's so good. <laughs> it's really, really good. Get in it, Cody. Get in it. You gotta try it. Alright, I'm in. Now for the main course. You won't even guess what's in there. What? What? Wait, you eat it like that? That's not a wrapper. Nope. That's a that's chocolate? A, yeah, that's a chocolate. It what? looks like a, oh my crystal, God. <laughs> like a crystal ball. I never seen anything like this. Is that, how's the blue though? How'd you get the blue on it? Do they know? I'm not sure really. It's like a chocolate. I feel like I'm, it looks like this chocolate It's like a paint. pearl. Whoa. This that. is amazing. It's like a. I wonder if, like, what it look like it looks if it like melted. It's like a bouncy ball. Yeah, it does. Wait, connect it. Connect it. <laughs> Combine. <laughs> That's a full one right there. It's okay. A, I'll oh, yeah, give me it back. Uh, I'll take this one. I'm going in. So. Oh, man. So after that amazing food, we decided to drive two and a half hours down to Swart Tyson. This is a national park here where a lot of people do glacier hikes and take some amazing photos. But check out the water. Look how the water looks. Actually, just check out the whole place. This place is beautiful. We are hiking that glacier. I've never done iceberg hiking or anything like that. But I just can't get over this color of the water. The whole weather is beautiful. It's clear, it's sunny. It's the perfect time to do this. It's actually 25 Celsius, by the way, here right now. Oh, hey, Josh. Hello, my name is Knut. Nice to meet you. Hey, man. Hello. Cody, nice to meet you. <laughs> Knut, nice to meet you. So to get over there, we have to take a boat. Oh, dude, we're going straight forward to the glacier. <laughs> Look at that view. Is there a certain name for the glacier? Or is it just called the National... Swart Eason. Swart Eason. Swart Eason. In no. Norwegian. In English, it means black ice. Oh, okay. Can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time Morning, evening and midnight Such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found. So a fun fact about this glacier is that it's the yeah. second largest one in all of Norway. And we're gonna do some ice climbing there. So apparently, before we do this, a surprise is we're gonna be kissing a moose. I don't even know, I don't know how this is gonna happen. Let's see how this turns out. Probably one of the nicest bike ride views I've ever seen right now. So relaxing here, even the air smells fresh. I feel like this is like the Goonie Squatter uh, from the Stranger Things. We're all just on bikes, chilling, <laughs> squatted up. Big baby moves. That's awesome. Hi, Cody. <laughs> Hi. Nice to meet you. Lena. Nice to meet you. Hey, Josh. Hi. Nice to meet you. Lena. Wow. All right, so we can go see this guy? Of course you can. Awesome. The gate has been opened. Yeah, we can now kiss the moves. Hello. Hey, buddy. What up? <laughs> I've never seen a moose this close. Look at him. This little girl, she is uh, one year old. One year old? Yeah. And that big? Uh, yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> How old is this guy? Uh, it's a lady. Oh, my bad. <laughs> she is uh, 12. Oh. Yeah, and her name is Wilma. 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 And the little one is called Embla. Over there. Yeah, that's the big one. Yeah, I was gonna say, because he's big. Yeah, he's big. Today goes down in history that I kissed the moose. And it's documented. Okay, I'm scared. He's gonna like bite me or something. See? So I just go up and do it. Oh! No. 
<laughs> I got it though, but I'll do it. I'll do it again. One more. Cool. Good. I feel like I achieved greatness. <laughs> first day at summer camp, boys. <laughs> You're like a first grader who just got us. <laughs> what did I call that? The, the fountain. All right. Fountain All right. So they said that you can actually drink this water, and it's that pure. And that you're not gonna get sick from it. I'm calling this the river of youth, and I think that when I drink it, I'm gonna become immortal. I'm going in for it. My hands are dirty, but you know I'm taking it all in. Ugh. Tastes better than Poland Springs in America. It's Norwegian Springs. Norwegian Springs. Taste the goodness. Cody's setting up the GoPro on my helmet. We're about to do it right now. Guys, this is the dream team right here. I'm hooked on to the instructor. So pretty much if I fall, he falls. So we're all in it together now. We're not falling, Josh. <laughs> I'm not falling this time. I even got spikes on my shoes. This is gonna be one great adventure. Plus, I got the GoPro ready. Let's do it. It's harder, but it's better. If your feet are a little bit wide, some space between your feet, you have the balance, better balance. Okay. You can use the axe as a stick, like this. Yeah. <laughs> I got in the most important phone call of my life, and I can't answer it right now. That's okay. It's because it's melting right here. Unexpected turnover. Oh! oh. oh well, that was <laughs> This is it. This isn't usually like this. <laughs> it's alright, the adventure is starting now. Going back again. Can we grab that? You need help? Oh, I love take, it. Take no, take his hand. I did something right for once. It's so weird walking on ice with these shoes. Like, I just feel like I'm gonna fall anytime, like I'm gonna slide, but it's not gonna happen. It's it's so unreal. I'm not used to this. This is insane. Right now our, our tour guide is uh, putting these needles into the ground so like if we fall, this rope, this harness is gonna just stay uh, nailed to those needles so we won't die. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, they're pushing my limits right now. I gotta get straight up this thing. Um, obviously I'm scared of heights, but we're gonna try. I'm just scared to try to get this foot <laughs> over there. So if I pull on this, I'm gonna be fine. Just don't kick yourself with the other foot. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> I this might be my new fun sport forever. This is crazy. It's Cody's turn. Well, I didn't take my my cam out. For we that. made it. That was so Dude. amazing. That, that was makes me want to like do like more winter stuff now. Because yeah. I hate the winter, but that made me want to do it. That was fun. Let's take up the drone and see what we can see. 